Hello YouTube, my name is James Yo, and today the title of my video is How to Download and Install Minecraft with the Pixelmon Mod for Absolutely Free. So, starting off there's a list of things we're going to need, and the list is basically Minecraft, Mineshafter, Forge, and Pixelmon. So, to get Minecraft, all we need to do is open up a web browser and go to Minecraft.net. And from here, click on the Already Bought the Game Download It Hero link. And then download Minecraft.exe. And once you download that, you're going to want to make sure that it's on your desktop or somewhere very accessible. So I have it right here in my downloads folder. I'm going to just drag that out into my desktop. So. The next thing we're going to need is called Mine Shafter, and that can be found by Googling Mine Shafter. And so here we are, mineshafter.info. We're just going to click on the download section and download Mine Shafter. We'll just save that to my downloads folder for now. We're also going to need Pixelmon. And here's the pixelmonmod.com slash blog, which is the most awesome epic mod ever, known to man ever. Anyways, so Pixelmon 2.5.7, this is the latest edition of Pixelmon. That's all they're ever going to have inside their download section. But if you need older versions, it's right here. There's a forum full of them. Um, but we do, I want 2.5.7, so I'm just going to download that link right there. And through AdFly, you just have to wait a few seconds and then click at the top, save. Anyways, just, just follow the normal routine to download files. And now from here, we need uh, Minecraft Forge 911, and that can be found right there. Same thing, follow the please wait and download Forge. So, once you have Minecraft, Forge, Mineshafter, and Pixelmon, all downloaded. What we want to do is grab Minecraft and drag it to the desktop like I've already done. And then we're gonna run that. And this is an important part, but you will need an actual login account starting off. Because when you first start, it's going to ask you to log in. And what you're gonna want to do is create an account if you haven't already and this is absolutely free this portion of it um, actually everything I'm showing you is absolutely free but if you just click on register here and then actually create an account and then confirm the account with your email address then come back to the screen and log in with your legitimate account so that's what I'm gonna do here log in and then we need to change our profile so that it is not it's not using use latest version. We need to change that to release 1.6.4. And then click play. And when we click play here, what it's gonna do is install 1.6.4 version of Minecraft so that we can play. Uh, we don't actually want to play though on that right now. What we're gonna want to do is install Forge immediately after this. So while that's uh, uh, downloading, what I'm gonna do is open up my downloads folder, and I'm gonna grab Forge and set that on my desktop. I'm also gonna grab Mineshafter and set that on my desktop. And then I also need Pixelmon, and we're just gonna set that on the desktop too, so I don't have to worry about my downloads folder anymore. Alright, so Minecraft has just finished uh, updating itself to 1.6.4. And now, once the game starts, what we're going to want to do is just immediately click Quit. And now that we've quit Minecraft and it's installed to 1.6.4, what we want to do is open up Forge and then click Install Client and click OK. And after Forge is finished installing, next thing we're going to want to do is open up Minecraft again.
and this time at the bottom here where there's profiles click on forge and then click play and if you choose to click edit uh, you will see that you're running release 1.6.4 on forge save the profile and then click play and now that forge has been loaded one time we are good to go all we need to do now is uh, put pixelmon into the mods folder and we can call it a day so let's see to get to your mods folder just open up any folder or any uh, browser and just type in percent app data percent hit enter click minecraft and then click on your mods folder you'll see I have no mods installed in there save my pixel monitor right there we're just gonna drag that into there and now pixelmon is in my mods folder and I'm good to go now I just gotta start up minecraft okay now to play on a server without having an actual uh, minecraft account what you're gonna need to do is uh, start your minecraft using mineshafter Now with Mineshafter, you can type in anything as an account. So I'm just going to type in Squirtle as a demonstration and type in something as a password. And then I'm going to click Login and then click Play. And I've already typed in the information for this, but the, um, the server I'm going to be playing on is called Pokin Smash, and this is the server information. It can be found down in the description, obviously. Pokin Mash, but this is the website for it. And so, s17.hosthorde.com colon two five six eight three. We'll double click that and get logged in. First time you log in, you will crash. That is a general thing that happens on any Pixelmon server. And now I get to choose my Pokemon. And I'm going to choose Charmander, mainly because it turns into Charizard, and then I have a Pokemon that flies. So to register, you just type in register. Um, just make my password, 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 and I'm good to go.